that's not true, Nathan. So uh, you're going to go on timeout and probably will be blocked because you're trying too hard. That was another BS garbage thing that uh, mostly Jimmy pushed forward that I made people wait. I made people wait because I was I was trying to orchestrate a freaking radio show. And when the stuff uh, that was in front of you at the time was really, really working, you didn't want to like bring someone else into the mix at that uh, particular moment. So you made him wait a little bit. Like Jimmy doesn't know crap about doing radio. All right, Minash, you win. Damn it, you win. You win. He didn't know crap about doing radio. Any good uh, good late night talk show host uh, understood this as well because the, there were guests that would wait in the green room for the entire time at Leno or Letterman. And you remember, they would go, well, we ran out of time, so blank, blank. We're going to reschedule him and get him back on the show in the very near future. But Jimmy just had to sit there and troll for undesirables and sp spit on the floor almost every day and then far to go, tee -hee! Doesn't know how this runs. It was a pressure cooker. So if the stuff was happening in front of you and was killing, you didn't want to really interrupt that. Sometimes we did, sure. But that was the reason uh, some people over the years had to wait. And guess who was the guy that would always run and go, I'm sorry that you waited, or I'm sorry you couldn't uh, be on today. And they would be like, oh, my God, no problem. Can I come back? Because they understood the power of the show. <laughs> 